I am starting off my series in no particular order. We're going to go with Yodema Houston. This is a clone of Hermes H24 and it's an aromatic green fragrance for men. It is a very fresh spicy fragrance in my opinion. It's aromatic, it's got some yellow florals on the, in there and it's it leans very green if that makes sense. Longevity wise, yeah, it's pretty decent actually, it does last a long time. However, I think it's a bit of a classic style scent where it's slightly powdery and floral and aromatic. I do find it a little bit powdery, so I would say it's a little bit, little bit old fashioned. I, I don't want to offend anyone or um, take this the wrong way, but I feel like the modern fragrances don't smell very similar to this anymore. This is very, very um, timeless. I'm not saying it's uh, old and, and useless anymore. I, I think it's a classic kind of scent to me. So um, it may be more suitable for someone a little bit more mature, a little bit more sensible, a professional possibly. But it is fresh. It is definitely fresh. And um, I think it is appealing. It smells clean. It smells really, really clean. So the, the notes in this is actually uh, sage. And I think um, the clone says that it has daffodil in there. So I guess that's where the yellow florals come in from. Um, but I do, I like this fragrance because it makes a change compared to all of my other fragrances. This one is classic, clean and fresh, but it's sort of like old style rather than the new style of the clean, fresh fragrances. For example, RYSLYs or Blue de Chanel's. This one's a classic fragrance, which is quite nice. It makes a change, you know. Uh, you definitely won't be smelling like every other person in the room, that's for sure. Longevity is really good on this fragrance. Couple of sprays and you're set. Uh, literally like if you don't like this fragrance and you put a couple of sprays on you you're screwed because you're stuck with it um, so yeah longevity is good projection is good as well so one thing or the two things that I like about Yodema is about 80 to 90 percent of their fragrances are powerhouses in regards to longevity and projection so really really good I don't know how they do it but I'm very impressed with most of their performance so but um yeah, like I said, this one's a very green fragrance, sort of floral, aromatic, uh, classic, timeless scent. Um, kind of similar to, uh, I'd say, um, our Yodema Capri, where it's like an old classic um, mature scent. But it's still fresh and clean, which is nice as well. So yeah, professional, yet uh, kind of playful as well because of uh, the freshness to it. So it's not seriously mature, but it is definitely grown up, I would say. I hope this makes sense. Um, the easiest way to understand what they smell like, of course, is to smell the original in the store before buying this clone. But in regards to this clone, I highly recommend it. It gets a thumbs up from me. I personally am not a huge fan of this scent DNA, but if you like the original, then you'll love this clone because of the performance. The performance on this one is amazing is amazing. I'm not lying. It's really fantastic. Longevity and projection is powerhouse. So um, if you do end up buying a bottle and you don't experience what I'm describing, it could be various different reasons. So please don't instantly assume I'm lying to you. It could be a bad batch or I got a really good batch or um, various different things. Um, so please, uh, this is just my opinion and um, don't take it as a guarantee. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this helped. If you have any questions, please post in the comments and I'll get back to you ASAP. I'm here to help. So any suggestions, I've got the fragrance myself. I can smell it um, and I can try and answer your questions as uh, much as possible. Yeah, I recommend this fragrance. I'll give it an 8 out of 10, which is a, a solid 8 as well, a good 8 because that performance is unreal. And yeah, that, that's pretty much what sways my um, opinion is the performance is fantastic. So... Um, in regards to scent DNA, if you like the original or if you like a classic old time, fresh, clean fragrance, a little bit flowery, a little bit uh, green in there. Uh, this one is good. It's a good option. I hope this helps. Thank you. Please leave a comment, a thumbs up if you like this video and subscribe if you haven't already. OK, thank you. Bye.